Hello friends, my name is Real Emil and welcome back to some more Gran Turismo 2. Today we're continuing on with our Let's Play. This is episode 66 and this is the episode where we finally finish all the one mate races for the E-City. There's only one more to do, it's the AZ-1 challenge. For that we need a Mazda AZ-1 and because the Mazda AZ-1 is actually a pretty rare vehicle, I bought one up earlier. In case you're wondering, this is my garage. Um, there's a lot of crap in it at the moment. Um, I bought an AZ-1 at some point. There we go. There's our AZ-1. I'll uh, show you through the garage properly once we've done all of the one mate races, just so you can see the ridiculous amount of cars I currently have. I'll also show you uh, the game status in this video uh, after we've done the City one makes, just so you can see how far through the game we actually are. Anyways, uh, let's head over and actually customise this little cool car, and yeah, let's do that. Okay, so there we go. That is our little Mazda AZ-1 upgraded. We're running about 177 horsepower, so this should be pretty interesting. Anyways, unfortunately, you can't racing modify the little AZ-1, so there's only one race. It's for normal style vehicles, and as always, it's on a random course. Our first and only race heads to Clubman Stage Route 5 for the tiny little AZ-1. Anyways, as you can probably see in this race, I've only got the standard AZ-1, there is a Mazda Speed AZ-1, um, which we just passed, there's only one in this race. Um, it comes with a little bit of a body kit on it, I don't think it actually adds any power or anything of note. Um, again, as I've said, apparently I've heard, seen on forums that these vehicles are actually pretty damn rare. So, um, yeah, I've just decided to go ahead and buy one. As soon as one popped up in a dealership, I bought one, um, which is why I had this one in my garage. Anyways, not going to lie, because this vehicle is so, so small, it actually really reminds me of, like, a car out of Micro Machines or something. This car is ridiculously small on this little racetrack. Um, admittedly, um, this is going to sound really weird, but um, the actual recording itself is in like 16.9 it's in some weird it's like 480p but not quite 480p so it looks a little bit wonky unfortunately i can't really fix the resolution um on this thing it's just sort of gonna be what it's like for ps1 games um but yeah unfortunately uh, if i can find a way to fix it i will um definitely do it but yeah um while that's running in sort of like widescreen this is actually running in um for free resolution on my TV so this car looks a hell of a lot smaller on my screen than it does in the recording window. Mind you, still looks smaller in the recording window. Um, so yeah, this car is like a little micro machine or something. To be honest with you, this is another car which I would kind of like to have a go in in real life just because I can imagine this thing is a hell of a lot of fun to chuck around. It comes with about 61 horsepower stock, it weighs basically nothing, I believe it's mid-engine rear drive. Yeah, I can imagine this vehicle is a hell of a lot of fun to uh, chuck around in real life. However, of course, this vehicle has one purpose and one purpose only, and that's to see us off in the East City One Mega Races. Finally, thank God, we are done with these things. We've been doing them since episode 38. We started with the Suzuki Auto Works, which was a slow and pretty gutless small car, and we end with a small and pretty gutless small car. Interestingly, apparently the Master Speed AZ-1 was the uh, slowest of the pack, which seems a little bit weird but there you go anyways um we win 3,000 credits not a lot of money but what would you expect and i will see you in a second there we go that's the az1 challenge complete and that's all the master one make races complete and that of course means finally all the one make races here in the east city are officially over in the next episode we're going to be heading over to the north city uh, to see what they're like anyway let's quickly check the game status we are almost 74 percent of the way through this game we're getting there guys we're getting there uh admittedly after the north uh one make races we have endurance races nationals internationals um the event synthesizers and the um full Gran Turismo World League. Uh, to be honest with you, they shouldn't take too long. So yeah, we are not too, f well, to be honest with you, we've still got about 30-ish episodes until we're finished with the GT mode. Um, but nevertheless, we are making progress, that's for certain. 
Anyways, friends, I want to thank you all very, very much for watching. And if you watched all the East City One Make races, then you seriously are a god. So, yeah, thank you all very much for watching. My name's been The Real Emil, and until next time, farewell.